there's a saying where that they say that another person's trash is another person's treasure. But then when you actually really stop and think about it for a minute, right? You have to ask yourself this question. Okay, well, what do you as the individual, what is it that you actually really consider to be trash? And then what does the other person actually really consider to be a treasure? Now, grant the fact I know this whole recycle bin shit, you know, everybody trying to save the earth. Right? Which I have no problem with that. But then when you actually really stop and think about, okay, well, which earth are you actually really talking about? Are you actually really talking about the earth that you actually really see outside every time you go outside your front door? Or whether every time that you actually really open up your garage door and back your car out, and you see what is actually really considered the earth, or actually like, are you actually really talking about the human body, your body, which actually really came from the earth, right? That's what the fuck you actually really gotta actually really stop and ask yourself. But then again, let's look at it like this, people. Everything that's on the earth today, right? Whether it is you as an individual, which you came out of your mama, right? Or whether it's something that you actually really go out and buy, right? Just know that for the most part, you had to go out and get it, open it up, see what was in it, and if it was actually good, you partook in it. Right? You know, whether it was a bag of potato chips or a motherfucking 40 ounce, or it was that, open it up, your girlfriend's legs or whatever, do whatever the fuck that you do. Right? You had to open up something to actually really get to whatever the fuck that you was actually really trying to get to. <laughs> and then for the simple fact for, you know, for you to actually really call the whatever it was, right, that you had to open up and get to it. And once it's empty, or so-called empty, you, right now, you actually really want to call it trash. But then again, you also got to actually really stop and think about it. Okay, is it really empty? Right? I mean, did it do what the fuck it was supposed to do? Right? And then, if it did what the fuck it was supposed to do, then it's not considered trash. Now, am I actually really telling you to actually really doggone hold on to everything that you've actually really opened up in your life? No, I'm not saying that because then your ass will actually really be classified as a hoarder. Well, you just keep shit, right? But the thing about it, though, is this. I know a lot of y'all might sit up here and think, well, well, goddamn, Kirk, what the fuck? You want everybody to like just hold on to each and every little thing that they had to open? I'm not saying that, but the thing, but what I am saying is this. Whatever it is that you have to really open, whether it's opening up a door or whether it's opening up a thought pattern that you actually really actually never thought about going down once before, right? You actually like might, just might. Well, actually, I really, actually, really stop and think about it. Okay, hey, look, 
this particular incident that has happened to me, right? I actually might want to write this shit down somewhere so that I can actually really remember it for long down the line, right? There's no such thing as trash, people. And for the most part, there's no thing. I mean, now, you, you, you may or may not want to actually really call it a treasure or, you know, but the thing about it, though, is this, people. We tend to actually really go off of what the fuck somebody else done told us. Right? Just like with the whole trash deal. We'll look at it and we're like, okay, that's trash. I'm going to throw it away. Or then it could be something that we can look at and say, that's a treasure. Oh, I'm going to keep it. Right? Because you actually really may think that it may have some value to you later on. But the thing about it though is this, people, what type of value are you actually really looking for? Are you looking for monetary value? Or actually really you looking for that type of value that money can never buy? That's what you got to ask yourself. Because a lot of motherfuckers, a lot of y'all love chasing the paper. And I'm not going to go on in the doggone song and dance about the value of paper. Or the value of money because I done did that too many times. Just go back and look at any of my other shows. And you, you'll know this. But my thing is what the fuck I'm actually really trying to tell y'all here is this. <laughs> There's no such thing as trash, people. Matter of fact, I'm almost about ready to say that it never was anything that considered as trash. And I'm not just saying it because, okay, well, you can go and you can recycle some shit. If you can recycle it, then, hey, by all means, do so. Do whatever the fuck you feel is right. Right? Right? But at the same time, people, don't sit up here and call everything goddamn trash. Because if you actually really stop and think about it for a minute, you came, like I said earlier, right? You came out of your mama. So is your mama trash? I mean, let's, let, you know, let's, 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 let's be, let's be reasonable here, Right? Now, your mama could be a crackhead, your mama could be a motherfucking alcoholic, prostitute, whatever the fuck. But guess what? She had enough about herself to lay down and have your motherfucking ass. And to actually really be like, to actually really say, hey, look, don't go down the same route that I did. Go out and do something better than what the fuck I did. So this whole deal about trash and treasure. <laughs> you know, I say that and I laugh. Right? Because, again, I know a lot of y'all could probably go sit up here and say, well, damn, what the fuck are you actually really talking about here? But if you actually really stop and think about it for a minute, right? This particular show, I say the same shit on every show that I actually really do, right? Don't always go off of what the fuck somebody done told you, right? Matter of fact, don't even go over what the fuck I done told you, right? I could be telling you bullshit, but you already know that is not the case. But then, just for y'all that ain't too sure about what the fuck I'm talking about, then yeah, go out and do that research. Do the research, people. Right? Because I could be telling you wrong. But just know this. Trash is not trash, people. And treasure... 
don't always have to have monetary value. Which that's what a lot of you motherfuckers actually really look for. Right? A lot of y'all don't actually really go out and like, okay, well, I can't get no money off of it. But then again, you might actually really want to go out there and take what the fuck somebody done told you and make money that way. But then again, then again, there's no, that is monopoly money. What the fuck that all of us make, right? So again, it ain't always about monetary value. Maybe, just maybe, that the value is that, okay, I ain't gonna go out there and do that bullshit because it's monopoly money in the first goddamn place. But a lot of people, the majority of y'all out there right today, myself included, right? Actually, I really go out there and take your so-called bullshit talents and actually I really think that we supposed to get paid for what the fuck that we can actually really do. And a lot of people not knowing that we ain't getting paid. We put like it. We ain't never got paid shit for our motherfucking talents. Yeah, you may have a house or apartment, car, two cars, clothes, food, lights, water, gas, the whole nine, right? But well, there's no this, people. It's all part of the plan. All part of a bullshit illusion. And if you actually like, really like put your mind to it and be like, you know what? I ain't even gonna do this. But how about my lights and shit still be on? Right? Which is something that I'm actually like, really trying to I've been actually like, really trying to figure that shit out too. Right? Because once because once I actually like, really figure it out. I'm going to tell y'all, consider if they don't kill my ass first, right? But the thing about it though is this, people. There's no such thing as trash. Never was trash. Even before motherfuckers actually really started recycling shit. Never was trash, people. Because, honestly... You had to take it and cover it up with something, right? So now that you have actually really revealed what the fuck it is, oh, now all of a sudden it's trash now. Got it. Holla at y'all.